because our value doesn't tell us how well it stops radiant heat from the sun or air move air moving through it. Our value is a test of conductive heat. That's heat moving through an object. So it's where our value kind of makes most insulation, all insulations appear to be really equal when they're really not, when they're under a lot of stress. So, and stress is when your roof deck heats up to 130, 140 degrees, that heat on the bottom side of that roof deck, the way it moves in your house is by radiant heat movement, electromagnetic wave trying to get in that house. So you want an insulation that stops that. And in the winter time, when you're heating that house, all that heat, heat moves from more to less. That's the only way it goes. So heat's gonna move from more to less. So in the winter time, that heat's gonna try to, by air movement, stack effect, it's gonna try to get up into that cold attic. So if you use an insulation, it's better at stopping air movement, then it's gonna keep your house warmer longer. Your unit doesn't have to run as much. You'll get all, your heating and air unit will last longer because it's not having to run all the time to try to keep up in the really cold days or on the really hot days. So a lot of benefits to insulate right. Not just lower utility bills, it's longer life of your heating and air equipment, things like that. And that's where our value is really misleading when we're trying to pick out the best insulation. 